it seems to start, I mean, you show desperation in the third period, but did it take you guys too long to get there? Absolutely. Absolutely. Not enough. Not enough. I mean, uh, we can sit here and, and ask why and why and why. It just it has to it has to change. Period. It has to. I'm sorry. Yeah. No. Is the disappointing point that, especially this game, you were just too easy to play against for 40 minutes? No question. Easy. Too easy out of the gate. Uh, and uh, that is a big lesson that needs to be learned now. Period. It's tough to take anything from the third when you start and you, you, you know, basically we lost the game through the first 20 so minutes. Um, so there is no, nothing to take from it after that. I mean, it's just uh, very disappointed that uh, uh, we didn't start better. What do you think happened to defensive coverage in that game? You know, I think t pretty simple for me, they, they, were willing to work harder out of the gate. They showed more determination out of the gate, and we were on our heels until we could not get on our heels. Uh, and that was that was, uh, you know, through the end of the first, we looked a little rattled in the second for for a bit before we got to our game. But uh, the first was was, you know, I think they they set the tempo through their work ethic. We did not. And we ended up on our heels as a result and very hesitant in the D zone to follow. Um, and it took us even a bit in the second to get going. Did you consider a, a goals are really pulling thread? I know we have a game around yeah. for a spark or something. Yeah, go, I don't think the goals were his, his fault or I can't, you know, if there was any fault of his, it was, uh, you know, more of a fault prior to the goal to end on any of those goals. So. Um, yeah, the thought always goes through your, your mind of, uh, you know, would this, would this change things? Would this be a spark? Uh, you know, is it even fair to leave men at, 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 at points you're going, obviously going through your mind, uh, back to backs going through your mind as well. Um, you know, I thought our guys, uh, you know, made the push and could have came back, but, uh, I didn't think it was going to come down to goaltending at that point. Cause I felt we were playing better. Didn't feel we were going to give up more, um, so you know the decision was to leave them in there. I don't think that was a factor, anyways. Regardless. What's the feeling for you when you see a lot of the mistakes getting repeated through the game? Uh, easy to get frustrated when you see that. Um, you know, when it's it's um, yeah, it's just easy to get frustrated. John. Since you've taken over this team, you've been able to take a group of very young players and get them to succeed after a skip like this. What what is the move and what has worked in the past? Uh, we'll push through it. I mean, we had uh, we'll push through it. They're, they learn. They, they learn from their mistakes. This group, um, and you know, um, they'll 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 learn from this. This will make them better, but it uh, doesn't lessen any disappointment uh, the, the, these are games that were right there uh, so you should have the expectation to win and with the expectation to win you should have the you know that that determination right at puck drop at seven o'clock and, and uh, you know win the, the the battle of who came to compete at the drop of the puck I felt that's that's where we you know this one night slipped away uh, and I felt that slipped away in, in Arizona so we have to um, uh, learn that, take that lesson to heart. Kind of on that same note, you talk about a need of increase in urgency. Is there a practical way that you can go about that and increase the urgency in the team leading into games? Uh, for, uh, can you go further on your question? Is there just a practical way that you can go about increasing we'll, the urgency? We'll, on the coaching side, we'll obviously continue to push um, and demand and grind if have to. Uh, so, yeah. Absolutely, you'll be doing doing plenty behind the scenes to not going to stand here and throw people under the bus. But um, but we, you know, if 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 your team can't get the push themselves or uh, through older, more experienced guys, obviously you're as a coaching staff looking to pick up where where needed.
Coach, not to throw anybody under the bus, but uh, last 11 games, three or more goals in each one in the last 11 games. Is it more defense or is it more goals? Well, we're, you know, on the defensive end, yeah, we were, uh, we, it's when you're not winning, it's, it's, yeah, you, we're, we're right there, but yeah, it's a little bit, I'd rather stick with the compete. <laughs> I think a little more competitiveness, a little more determination um, would flip a lot of these, uh, these scenarios that we're, we could talk about. Has the team thought about even calling up UPL at any point as far as goaltending is concerned? Yeah, you know, the goaltending uh, we don't see as the issue at all right now. There's other things that need attention, and, you know, they fall in line more with that. They compete, as I said. Uh, you know, there's there's lots of – when you have a greater intensity and competitiveness, lots of things remedy themselves as a result. So we could look at things in different categories, uh, but that's one big – that's that's a big category in itself that covers a lot of ground. How do you think Paterka responded to a more physical game? Uh, there were instances where JJ was was good. There's also instances where he, he can he can do more. There's no question he can do more. And um, you know, with with a younger player like him, you're going to bring that to his attention to show him how he can do more, what he, more he can do. Uh, you know, he was okay, but there's there's a lot more there. Speaking about doing more, what's the conversation like during this get in the locker room with the younger guys? You know, you have to stay in the now. So. Uh, you know, we have to take a look at this one, and we'll look at it the way I've explained to, to the room here, and uh, simplify a game plan tomorrow, and play direct, simple, and hard, and that would be the objective.